RFID technology comprises the process and physical infrastructure by which a unique identifier and potentially other data are transferred from a device to a reader via radio frequency waves. The simplest RFID system or infrastructure has three major components. An RFID tag, an RFID reader, and a non-physical predefined protocol format for the information being transferred. The tag is a small radio transceiver that has a minimum of two components. A microchip that holds data and the electronic circuitry required for transceiver functionality and an antenna used to send and potentially receive radio signals. The reader is usually a larger radio transceiver that has at a minimum the same two components as the tag. The reader is connected to a computer network or system to which it transfers the information from the tag. There are two primary RFID systems, passive and active. In passive RFID systems, the tags contain no power source and instead rely on the magnetic field provided by the reader to power the electronics of the tag's chip. Because there is no innate power source in passive RFID systems, the range of communication is usually short, less than 30 feet or 10 meters normally. In active RFID systems, the tag contains a power source, usually a battery. The power source feeds the chip circuitry. Therefore, it has a much longer transmission range of up to 1.2 miles or 2 kilometers in open fields. 